Hey everyone, I'm 7 First Alert meteorologist Mike Taylor. Just talking about some rain rolling through right now. We will focus in on your Wednesday. There could be the potential for a winter weather advisory with ice as the main threat. And it could even be upgraded to a winter storm, ice storm warning, I should say. So let me take you through what's going on. First, I'll get you through the rain. Uh, we're doing this update roughly around 5 o'clock or so. We're expecting the cold front to swing on through. When that happens, two things. The rain will pick up, it'll turn heavy, and then behind that cold front, we'll feel the difference. We're going to drop about 25 degrees between tonight into your Tuesday morning. In other words, it's just going to feel like winter again. So we'll get a little bit of sunshine into the day tomorrow, so a mixture of clouds and sun. Temps are going to be in the 30s and upper 20s during the course of the day and even in the afternoon. We may warm up a little bit, but by warm up, I'm still talking temps in the low 30s. Now, with the cold air in place, this is where things get interesting. We're going to have a warm front approach. It's going to cause something called overrunning. That's a recipe to produce some ice and potentially some sleet. But at this moment in time, it does appear that ice is going to be the main threat based on how the atmosphere is set up. So let me take you through this. Once we get into Tuesday night, roughly around 3 a.m. into 4.30 in the morning, we're going to see some wintry mix moving in. Ice appears to be the dominant feature within this setup and then it will continue from Wednesday morning into the afternoon hours and potentially into your Wednesday evening. Therefore, we can get about a solid 12 to 18 hours of rain that could freeze at the surface and that's going to cause some issues here. So uh, for tonight, we're down to around 32. Showers come to an end, will be mostly cloudy. Tomorrow we bounce back only to 36. And then once we get to Wednesday, that's when the story sets up. Wednesday morning appears to be uh, when things really get bad for us. So just a quick summary, freezing rain and sleet likely. Icy roads in the morning starting as early as 6 a.m. and beyond. Power outages based on the weight of this ice looks likely as well. And to give you a scenario, uh, in order to reach an ice storm warning criteria, you need at least about a quarter of an inch of ice. Well, models are going well above that, and the blend of them all shows that we can see up to uh, three-tenths of an inch of ice, maybe a tenth of an inch near areas like Shelby and Pontiac, but all in all, it doesn't take much ice to cause an issue. I'm thinking we'll get enough to really cause some problems for Wednesday. After that, we have another round of a wintry mix on Thursday, and then we stay cold as we go into the weekend with lows in the teens and highs only in the 20s. A lot of weather going on this week, so be sure to download your Storm Shield app and also the 7 app. We'll keep you up to date as we always do. Thanks for joining us here and trusting us with your weather information at WXYZ.com. Next planned update would be by Kevin for your Tuesday morning.